If you ask golfers in Ontario what they know about Kingston, golf probably isn't the first thing on their minds. The first capital of Canada, home of the hip, Doug Gilmore and Don Cherry, and the occasional street party. But halfway between Toronto and Montreal, there's also a thriving golf community, and Cataraqui is its centerpiece. And it's a special place for us at TPL too. We became friends through junior golf in the Kingston area and the golf team at Queens, and we've learned a lot from Cataraqui. It taught us the importance of missing greens in the right places and how to chip. It taught us to value the skill of Canada's great golf architects and the challenge of a good par three. And it taught us that great golf courses like Cataraqui often produce the best players. Let's see what we learned today. One is a short downhill par four that's trickier than it looks due to its rolling fairway, difficult green complex, and severely sloped green. Welcome to the first of four outstanding par threes. Uphill and over 200 yards, if the first didn't feel like it tested your game, the second's a rude awakening. Long is dead, but short gives you a chance at an up and down. Three's a great score here, but if you can make it two, you might find yourself with a skin at the end of the day, especially if the pin is on the top shelf. The third is one of the coolest green sites on the property, and it slopes away from the ridge that runs along the right side of the hole. It's a tough par, but if you get through the first three holes in 12 shots or less, your round's off to a great start. And then you get a nice break on four, the first par five of the round. The fairway snakes left off the tee and then back to the right, ends with an undulated green that's severely sloped from back to front. If you play to the left side of the fairway, you'll have your best chance hitting this green in two, but don't miss long. This is your best chance at an early birdie on the round, but bogey's definitely in the cards if you play it wrong. While you're here, take a look over the green at the 15th hole and mentally prepare yourself for the toughest shot of the day. The eighth is a tough little par three. The green slopes back to front, left to right, and it's perched up on a little plateau. There's literally no good miss here, so if you make par, take it and run fast to the ninth tee. I love the tee shot on 12. The huge elevation change doubles the time your ball spends in the air, adding to the anxiety of the shot. The green is heavily soaked back to front and right to left, and is protected by a pawn and several bunkers. Hit the green, or you may be looking at a double. Fifteen has to be one of the strongest par threes in the province. It's 200 yards, uphill, and into the prevailing wind. With trouble on three sides of the green, short is your only miss. Three here always feels like a birdie. And after likely grinding out par worse on 15, you get to let off some steam and send it with driver on 16. Your last par 5 of the day, 16 is on the easier side, reachable in 2 for bombers, and a simple 3 shotter for everyone else. Just make sure if you miss the green, it's either short or right and this holds a piece of cake. 17 on the other hand can make you sweat. Like many risk reward par 4s, hit the longest club you can stomach to have the shortest approach possible into this narrow and heavily protected green. We could see many wagers being won, lost, or pressed here. I love 18, it's such a good finisher. The tree in the fairway really forces a decision off the tee. Do you bomb driver and hope for a flat lie with your wedge? Or do you lay back and have a mid iron in? The green sits in a really nice natural bowl. If you don't hit the green here, it's a really tough up and down. There's something about Cataract Way that takes you back in time. The trees are big and old. The fairways bump and roll the way you'd expect they did before modern equipment was used to build golf courses. It might not be exactly the way Stanley Thompson built it, but it sure feels close. <laughs>